So what's the difference between osteoarthritis and rheumatoid arthritis? This is a really common question and lots of people want to understand the simple distinction. Well, simply put, osteoarthritis is the wear and tear that our bodies get as we get older. It's true we don't all wear and tear at the same rate and in the same places, but osteoarthritis is considered to be the process of aging. We know it's a bit more complicated than that, but we haven't quite got to the bottom of it yet. Osteoarthritis tends to occur in the hips, in the knees, in the big toes, the base of the big toes, at the base of the thumbs, in the neck, and to some extent in the lower spine. These are the areas that are most affected by osteoarthritis. And of course, as we get older, osteoarthritis becomes more and more prevalent. Now, rheumatoid arthritis is very different. Our immune system, which is designed to attack infections like mumps and measles, shouldn't be attacking the body. In rheumatoid arthritis, the immune system sees our own body, and particularly the synovium, the lining around our joints, as foreign, and sets up an attack against our joints. So it's an active process driven by our, the immune system, and it's not a condition that tends to occur in older age. In fact, the classic patient will be a young woman. It can also occur in older age, but more typically occurs in young women in their 20s, 30s and 40s, and that's rheumatoid arthritis. So osteoarthritis associated with age and with degenerative change, that means wear and tear over time, and rheumatoid arthritis more common in younger patients, more common in females, and is an autoimmune process. Now that makes a huge difference when it comes to treatment, because for rheumatoid arthritis, the treatment is around drugs that suppress this immune system, the autoimmune response, whereas in osteoarthritis, those drugs really have no role at all.